Today we have one job on the SBC to glory, and that's for us to make this team better. And how are we gonna do that? By completing the brand new 87 player pick pack that EA Sports dropped, and they dropped an incredible looking Bamba, and if you know this channel well, then you know that Bamba has always been a big, big part of this channel. I mean, that card is always amazing in FIFA. So for us to jump directly into the content, I already built the brand new Bamba card. After that, we're gonna open up, I think they dropped a middle icon pack, we'll pop that open, and then we'll do the 87 player pick and check out how good Bamba really is. We got so much to do, lads, and, and obviously open up the 87 is, is the main thing we want to do in this episode here, but we also want to find out how good this Bamba card is. He looks incredible, but I'm more excited for the 87 player pick, but I'm also excited for this. I don't know. I'm excited for everything. Very, very good content from EA Sports. This guy's 92 pace. He's got 85 shooting. He's got 86 passing. He's got 86, I mean, 90 dribbling. It's a fantastic addition to Ultimate Team this season. I believe he's a five-star skiller, a four-star weak foot everything about bomba looking very saucy and you know with this card you know this guy bomba is always going to come with good agility good balance and good ball control that's a hundred percent what you're getting the positions a little bit eh because he plays left wing or left mid so we're gonna have to move mbappe inside which could see us having to drop my boy pele but we're not going to worry about that yet as we got to go ahead and open up our middle eye compact Right here, you can see that you are guaranteed an 87 over. I'm not sure if this is the middle icon pack one. I'm not sure about that one, but we're going to open it up regardless. It is a lot of coins, 500,000 coins. Remember, if you are a fan of this series and you enjoy the series, hit that big old thumbs up, man. Can we hit that thumbs up? Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you got out of your pack. We're going to pick up a goalkeeper. Oh, nah, nah. 88 overall, not from an SBC, which means he's going into an SBC. It's SBC to glory. We can only use players in our starting 11 that we got from an SBC. What else is in this pack, baby? Some good fodder, boys. Oh, 99, 87 rated um, uh, Europa uh, Confidence League, I guess you can call that card. And a uh, couple player picks, man. Or a couple, uh, uh, yeah, picks. Um, so we're going to get El Sharawi, legend of the game, legend of FIFA's. If you're an old school FIFA player, you know all about him. And then the one and only Voran and Kaka. So we get Kaka as a, a, 40, uh, four, a 14 game loan. That's a dub. The next pack we're going to open up contains one middle icon pack. These are never really worth it, if you ask me. 400. 150,000 coins, by the way. We're going to rip it open, see what we get in the comments down below. Please let me know what did you get from yours. I got to know, bro. I need to know. What did y'all get? Did y'all get something actually worth it? I could have swore I just got rid of that stuff. I guess not. Um, game is tripping, but hey, let me know what you guys, man. Did you guys get a good icon? Did you guys get someone that's usable? Mine is going to go into an SBC no matter what because it is an SBC to glory. We can finally open up the pack and our icon that we are going to get is going to be German striker straight in i was gonna say straight into an spc but muller you know what dude i was thinking it was gonna be closer now muller's not really the best thing in the game that's for sure not many people are rocking out with this car i'm not sure what his skill moves are oh some decent fodder in there four star four star muller is i'm not sure what his price tag is let's find out 100k he's definitely going into an spc he's not tradable definitely going into an spc but 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 it's a pretty cool pack EA drops. Never really worth it. Everyone always op tells me to open up my 10 coin pack. So let me get that out the way. So nobody in the comments down below yells, I get a foot birthday. Wow, Italian El Shirawe from my 10 coin pack, yo. What? That is actually stupid. <laughs> yo, that is actually stupid, lads. I just got El Shirawe from my 10 coin pack obviously doesn't sell for a stupid amount but that's a solid card to pick up man left winger left forward le uh, left mid left winger uh striker center forward um goes for like 70k uh five star skiller three star weak foot not bad i ain't mad at that 10 coins and we get that that is pretty impressive and we get some more loan players man not that we're really gonna use them but we get some more loan players i've completed all two steps to the uh 87 pl player pick i gotta do the um the the last one it's just an 85 rated team so let me build this really quickly and uh, we'll see what we get. It is officially done. I hope I get something good. I think you can get Ginola out of this. Fan uh, uh, fantasy foot hero, you can. You can get Ginola, lads. Do you know how incredible that would be if we got Ginola? Like, Ginola would be obviously the one I want because he goes with Mbappe um, and he links Bamba. It's just, it would be fantastic, right? Because I believe he's from the French League. And hopefully, he's from the. Is he French League? Actually, he might be. He might not actually be French League. Mm, I'll have to check it out. But anyways, here we go, man. Let's see what we get out of it. 87 World Cup player pick. No Ginola, but let's talk about it. This is a fantastic midfield card. A lot of people run this guy as a center mid. He is an incredible hero. We got Crouch, which would be fun to play with. Ocampos is terrible. 
this is a great pickup i know a lot of y'all probably like really a lot of people use this guy as a box to box in this game he is incredible incredibly value uh, valuable and that's why his price is still almost 300,000 coins because many 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 people use that card as a box to box and i might just do the same thing so this is the lineup we have and you guys know that i really don't like zidane so we are officially gonna drop zidane and we are gonna insert the one and only big boy i can't say his name every time i say his name it doesn't come off right so i'm not gonna say it. i usually call him kite okay i'm just gonna call him kite all right my man kite he's in the lineup right he's a box to box he is very very clean but now with that being said in kunku is no longer on full chemistry which kind of stinks how do we make that fix i'm not gonna lie i thought i I had all the answers i knew how to fix it i don't i can get the team almost on full chemistry except for Nkunku, who's on two this is the one problem i always have with Nkunku. getting him on chem is extremely hard i dropped my boy pele man my boy pele is now down on the reserves obviously gonna be a substitute i really really miss my man darwin nunez he is unbelievably good but remember i did not get him from an sbc so me using him is kind of cheating it is and yeah this is the lineup i officially have now i do want to tell you one thing and one thing only and it's very very important for me to tell you Dropping Pelé and Cruyff is probably not the smartest thing in the world. But with that being said, I enjoy using new cards. I enjoy having fun with other cards, right? I don't enjoy using the same thing every single weekend. It gets very boring very, very quickly. So I'm in the 4-3-2-1. This formation got us 20-0 many, 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 many times. Conte defensive mid. My boy Kite on the left. My boy Nkunku on the right as a cam. But Bamba and uh, uh, and Bamba, Messi and uh, Mbappe would be up top and Nkunku would be here. Or I can switch Bamba to go back here and put in Kunku up there as a striker with my boy Mbappe maybe even leave in uh, uh, Kunku as the solo striker with Mbappe supporting him that's a good look as well with Bamba being more as the cam so this is the lineup that I have put together around what we got very very happy with the upgrade in the middle of the park very very nice upgrade Be beautiful box to box player once I throw a shadow on him he is incredibly statted up nicely we like that we love that I don't have a shadow we hate that let's throw an anchor on him same thing only different tell you I do miss Pele Cruyff and my man Darwin Nunez like a lot I ain't gonna lie I really really miss them because I really really like them but at the end of the day this car this team looks very very sick and for me to get in Kunku to work who I wasted a lot of money on I have to drop some players and i still don't have him working unless i put zidane back in but i don't like zidane all right let's run it up it's officially our second game of the weekend league and my man has a beautiful team my midfielder that we just packed he has incredible i'm really hoping that bomba is special i ain't gonna lie to you like i've said to you multiple to multiple times Bamba is somebody that I always enjoy a lot in FIFA just because it's dribbling and how, how quick he is. But his first touch there was pretty bad. I got my boy Nkunku chilling on it. He goes back to Bamba. Bamba with a nice pass into Mbappe. Mbappe back to Bamba. Bamba weak footed off the crossbar. It was a great attempt. Nice pass to Mbappe. He hits the relax. Shoots. We're up by one. No Bamba nobody none of our new guys really involved but one thing i do want to say to you guys very quickly is the introduction of the brand new midfield or uh, mid oh he's doing the cheese goal lads and he's on side let me finish what i was saying he scores here because of a cheese goal but i want you to know that that's pretty much his first time getting forward because of the new introduction of our midfield that we got from our player pick oh no not like this. Good defense. Um, he's barely gotten forward except for an absolute cheese goal of popping it over the top off of a kickoff. We were cooking him. Here's Nkunku. He sends that straight to Mbappe. Is this guy a goalkeeper mover? Of course he is. I should have known. What a lucky goal. I even red timed it. I'm actually glad I got lucky there because he hit me with a cheese goal. That's number one. And num let me let me run backwards. I know what you're doing, bro. I know what you're doing, bro. I know. Look, I have my guy waiting. You're a cheeser, bro. Get out of here. Here's Nkunku. Nice pass. Bamba making this run. Look at the ball movement. It's clean. It's messy. Messi goes back to Mbappe. Mbappe hits the roulette. Can't get through. Look at Bamba go. Nice play, Bamba. Nah, you got to find someone. Nice pass to Messi. He shoots. We score. It's an assist for Bamba. Remember, your right center mid in the 4-3-2-1 is going to be aggressive. He's going to be in the box a lot. That's why Bamba goes ahead and gets the assist for us. We force a quick rage quit. This guy was cheesing. That's the only way he could really score on us. Our midfield was incredible, bro. Honestly, man, I think people should do the 87 uh, player pick for the chance of you getting an incredible midfielder like this. 300K, dude. I am extremely happy. I got 
got this box to box because I've been lacking midfielders. Now with Nkunku coming in, this man coming in, Conte coming in, I got so many midfielders. I'm just happy to have them all. I know a lot of people will call me crazy, so I'm going to move my boy Bamba up top and I'm going to move Nkunku back to where he belongs, which is a midfielder, but he's still playing the cam, so he'll be aggressive. He'll be attacking. He'll probably be more aggressive than Bamba, to be honest with you. And we're going to put Bamba as the second striker next to Mbappe as we jump into game three of the weekend league. So this is game two. And he got himself a nice Courtois, Xavi Alonso, my boy Jack, who they say just had one of the best games of his career for Man City. I think I read that properly when I was looking online. Not sure if it's true, obviously. Here's Nkunku. I didn't watch the game. Here's my boy Mba uh, Bamba. Bamba cuts inside. Nice ball roll. Bamba still with it. Hits a skill move really quickly. Staying with his Bamba. Bamba still with it. Works by one. Works by another. Finds Nkunku in the box. Shoots. And I told you. Things are going to get juicy when you got a midfield with players that can score, players that are aggressive. Bamba and Nkunku getting involved. The French connection, beasting and feasting. That's what we like to see. Come on. Look at the way he wins the ball back so quickly. Here's Bamba. Raised it up. Stays with it. Passes to Mbappe. Mbappe dribbles by one. Shoots. And Mbappe. And, 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 huh? Bamba. And, uh, Bamba. Bamba. And Bamba. I can't even speak anymore, bro. What an assist, bro. What an assist, man. Uh, from Bamba, dude. Absolutely incredible. He has three assists in two games. I'm pretty sure he assisted in both those goals. He did. Um, and he assisted in the first goal of the first game. He has three assists already. He is playing very, very, very good. And for his price tag, I'm loving him because he was not expensive to do at all. We're jumping into another game with our two new additions to the team. And lads, I just got to be honest with you. My boy, has, my boy has CR7. It's been an awesome journey just building this SBC to glory. Remember, players that are on my team are only players from SBCs. And these cars that we're adding through SBCs are just so good. And it's so hard for me to actually put a team out because I complete so many SBCs. I want to use them all. Good steal from Conte. Let my man get involved. Nice. Good passing. The midfield controlling the game is what we like to see. Here's my boy Nkunku. Bamba. I did a skill move, it didn't come off, but yo, I'm actually glad it didn't come off. I literally didn't move a lot, which set my opponent into panic mode and he left me all by myself. I don't know what this guy was thinking on defense, but thank goodness my skill move didn't come off because I did a McGee spin there. Somebody play D. Somebody play defense. Big Al scores on us, lads. Nah, we got to do a little bit better there. That was awful from us. All right, so the last guy hopped out at 1-1. I don't even know if I'll show you. He just backed out. I think it was because we were cooking him. Um, this guy hopefully actually plays, and Mbappe stays with it. And, oh, man, and Kunku's kind of making a good run. <gasps> and Kunku. Not, no, you got to beat Sergio Ramos there. This guy has Vieira and my boy Zidane. Good team. Bamba. Nice find. Can he shoot? Bamba scores. Come on, Bamba. What a goal, dude. He's back, lads. He's as he. Oh, oh, are you gone? Are you gone? Nah, there's no way he's gone that early. Yo, Bamba is back. This guy cooked me in last FIFA, I believe it was, on the RTG. And he's back on the SBC to glory. Obviously, I have Pelé. Obviously, I have Cruyff. So for him to stay in the starting 11 will be extremely difficult. But I love that he's making it be a hard decision for me. I love that he's making me have to think about it. I love that. I love having options. And that's exactly what he's doing for me. Here's Mbappe. Mbappe goes to my boy Nkunku. Nkunku goes back to Bamba. <laughs> Bamba try to go for the heel to heel. Maybe a pen ref. I'm just saying, maybe a pen ref. Mbappe. Come on, Messi. Come on, Messi. Come on, Messi. Nobody to help Messi. Nobody to help Messi, but he goes by himself. It's what Messi does. Messi hasn't been involved at all. I would say Mbamba, uh, uh, Bamba and Kunku and, 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 and Mbappe have been the most involved. Messi's been really, really lacking um, the offensive help, but he comes up big in this game, which is nice. Bamba, nice roulette. I should have done it. Pen, let's go! Yo, he tripped me as I made a mistake. I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have done the little rainbow there. That was so stupid. I had Mbappe with the sweat. That was, oh, look at our new man. Oh, hey, what's up, lad? Take it. Take it, lad. Our new man steps up. Not only is he dominating in the middle of the park, but he's scoring pens. 3-0, another rage quit. We are flying through games, boys. We won three, one backed out at 1-1. We are big boy chilling, and my boy Bamba this time gets a goal. More of the story is this. Every SBC I completed today, I would do again. For example, completing this card was huge. Why? 
Him as a box to box is something that my SBC to glory has lacked massively. Getting him to go right beside Conte is a blessing. I love it. Obviously, would I have taken Ginola? Yeah, but did I need Ginola? Messi, Mbappe, and Kunku, uh, Bamba, Pele, Cruyff, uh, 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 Darwin Nunez, even though he's not from an SBC. Not what I'm lacking. In the middle of the park, needing him, having Conte, uh, Lucatelli, having uh, Sabi. I don't really have that many midfielders. So would I do that SBC again? 10 out of 10, I would do it 100 percent again then let's talk about bamba this is a fantastic fantastic spc i think he comes in under 60k to complete my man scored got three assists and two goals in four games i remember one of the games the guy backed out so that take that game out three games two goals three assists fantastic player played him one game in the middle as a cam another game as a second striker i love bamba man he is a great addition is he going to be better than your croy for your pele probably not but if you need somebody to give you more of an attacking option if you want somebody new with five star skills high high a good card this fantastic card man i really really like it i would do it again i think these two sbcs can transform your team 100 percent. i think y'all should definitely give them a try i really like jonathan bamba and the proof is in the pudding man you just watch me play four games with him and absolutely barbecue chicken and big ups to my premier league legend aka liverpool legend thank you so much for the help in the middle of the park he's a fantastic pool thank you all for watching big thumbs up subscribe turn your bell on sbc glory back for the next one probably in like a day or two maybe tomorrow we'll see peace